Hello, everybody, and a good day to you all. Today, I'm talking about the God of High School, season number one, episode number 11, Lakey. And episode here, we have a lot of things happening. Things are getting crazy. This show is elevating to a whole nother level. Excuse me right now. We have Park and we have Maury fighting, right? Park has just trans, trans, transformed into the Nine-Tailed Fox, and now he's using his powers, and it looks like Maury does not have a chance of winning. Does not have a chance of winning at all. But something switches along the way because Mori managed to tap into a little bit of his, like you could say, Monkey King powers. I'm pretty sure he's the Monkey King. Because, see, Mori hasn't been using any Churyak at all. He's, he's, he's seen the, the borrowed power and stuff. He doesn't like that. He wants the power to come from himself. And even though he tried to do, do different techniques like that, the things, the things that he did learn by watching other people, it still didn't work. But somewhere on the, on the fight, it looks like he was like tapping into that Monkey King power, and then he managed to pretty much win the fight. Which was the fight was amazing. The animation, the animation, everything they do a fight is just fantastic. The animation, the scene, the scene rise up to a whole new level every every single time. And on the outside, you still got Park. I mean, you still got um um Mujin, and you had this um um the the the, the um the, the bad guy with the white hair. They're not fighting anymore. They they realize the the key the Nine Tail Fox just lost, and the other guy he doesn't exactly he's not sure how he lost, but he realized, you know he you know he knows the thing that going in his favor. But but um but um, Mu Jin he 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 knows he knows why he why he lost. He's just not saying anything. So that fight's over with. They they escape. And then you think everything is going back to normal. Then you think everything's going okay. And then you have this one dude who was in the hospital because when um, Park awakened his um, nine tail fox powers, it pretty much touched inside of him. And now he now he's now his brain went back to the fight he had with um, with um, Jagal, and he wants to win that fight. And he pretty much turns into some kind, some kind of a demon type of creature. I mean, things get crazy. And then he ends up getting getting his face his body bitten apart. But also at the same time, Park and his um his Park's friends, one girl lost her leg, other girl lost her arm, and because they got in the middle of the fight, and, and, and but the, but Jug all just want to win so badly, and also want to keep the key to himself. But I'm not sure what his plans are for it because they because you got one group over here who wants to wants to power up the key to pretty much um control the gods, I think, or kill them, and you got Park who's trying to stop them from getting that getting that power. So it's like a whole lot of stuff happening. You got this, this dude in the hospital whose whose power is awakened, turn him into some type of demon creature who, who absorbs people and he ends up absorbing almost absorbing on um, Park's friends, but end, end up getting his his head bitten off. Which leads in, at least at least Park and, and Jagal into another whole, whole fight, and because of that fight and what's going on there and the whole outside war that nobody knows, that knows about, Mu Jing decided to people say, you know what? Well, the God of High School tournament is over now because you see the thing is the whole point of the tournament was to find the key. When they found the key, now tournament's over. What's the point? What's the point of the tournament now? So now things about to get even more crazy. Things about to elevate to a whole nother, another another level. People having godlike powers. Because here's the thing. I don't think when Park turned into the to the nine tail fox, I don't think that was a Churyak. I don't think it was. I think it's something else. Either he actually is the nine tail fox reincarnated as a human, or he actually doing a Churyak or something or something else altogether. I'm not so sure. Because when everybody used their Churyak powers, it manifests on the outside of their body. Like when Jagar uses his shark outside. When one of the judges used her, her, his dragon outside, the Joker did the judge Q outside. Everybody, everybody power comes outside. But he was the first person who actually literally tra who actually transformed into the night. Of his hair turned white. He grew ears. His eyes changed in color. He had the, the fire tails. And then you have um, Mu Jing, Mormi Mori, when he tapped into his power. He didn't use cherry. It looked like he didn't use cherry cherry either. Really, it looked like he was starting to slowly transform into the monkey king. Like his pose started to appear in his hand, but it wasn't. It was like almost there, but it wasn't. And you saw a little bit of his power. He was just tapping to it just a little bit. So I don't know if the power actually is from them outside force. Is he actually isn't the monkey the monkey king? And he just been re, re, trapped. Uh, he just been turned into a human for for reasons. I I, I don't know. I don't know. So much I don't understand, but but let's, let's go on this journey. Watch out how things get explored, but just fan, uh, um, yeah, 
It's fantastic because you're, you're learning a little more every time. You, the powers and abilities are amped up to a whole nother level. The, 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 the animation demonstrating these powers and abilities is just mind blowing also. Oh, this show is so good. It's so, so good. I'm not sure how this is going to end because we're wrapping up pretty soon, but I'm looking forward to seeing it because. Wow, because now we're at a whole other level now. Things are about to go crazy now. You got Park and Jagal fighting in the middle of the street. You got Wu Jane calling off the, the tournament thing. And now, because the other dude bring, bringing in like, demons for another a portal or whatever that thing, those things were. So I just, things are about to go crazy. And I'm still not so exactly sure what are um, Park and, uh, and, and Mori? Are they even human? Are they gods themselves? I don't know. Looking forward to finding out. So, leave your comments down below. Let me know what you thought about this episode. Because I thought it was amazing. So, leave your comments down below. Let me know what you thought about it. If you haven't watched it, check it out for yourself. Hopefully you watched it. You would enjoy having watching it too. So, give me a chance to like, hit the thumbs up. Shaboop. And subscribe to my channel and share. I would appreciate it. If you're not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to come to 1,000 subscribers. Hopefully my journey to get there. For all those who have subscribed, I just want to say thank you. Like I always say, in my dreams of life, I am... The Ninja Rabbit. Uh, peace out, uh, people.